The climate and food and grocery production are intrinsically linked and our industry is very supportive of the ambition of achieving net zero carbon emissions by 2050 and a number of our members have measures in place to actually reduce emissions significantly by 2030. We are looking at across the supply chain how we can work with farmers, with retailers, with transport and logistic companies, with governments to be able to reduce emissions. Some of the areas include improvements in soil quality and yields working with farmers. Within manufacturing, we're using new technologies to be able to reduce the amount of water and energy that are used in production, to also be able to use technology to reduce the amount of wasted product. And then we're working closely with consumers and retailers as well to understand things like uh, improvements in uh, packaging formats and giving information about how to better recycle products. Technology is crucial for the industry to be able to move in a direction of being more sustainable, efficient and resilient as an industry. And there are a number of different areas that we can adopt that technology from production through to providing more information to consumers, as well as all throughout the supply chain to make sure that we've got more efficiency and minimising any wasted resources.